Uh, good afternoon and welcome once again to Mercer Locomotive Works here in Trenton, New Jersey. Uh, today we're going to do a little bit of machine work and I wanted to show how we do that and we're going to work on here on the bridge port and we're going to do some rotary table work. Uh, we'll be making we're making this marker lights for the Pensy K4 the 1361. This is the modern marker light. They call it a coffee can marker. It's far far Cans from a coffee can. wing nut. Um, this is uh, Charles Nelson, of course, and he wanted to let you know that he just graduated from school, and he graduated from a very important school, the School of Hard Knocks. So he wanted to let you know that. Uh, I'm going to do this as a manual machine now. We don't use uh, CNC here at all in the shop, and uh, although Charles Nelson Corrigan CNC wants us to, but we're not going to do it, right, Charles? Well. So uh, we're going to proceed with the machining and how I how this works. I'm going to indicate the vice. I'm going to then do the machine work, drill the holes, and use the rotary table. And then the end so result. What we're doing in this operation and when we're, is we're using an indicator. This is a I don't even know what they call this indicator, but I've had it for years, and it, and it, it you can run the machine actually run the machine while I'm indicating the center of the rotary table, so I know the exact center of that rotary table. Once I get that. Set the, read out to zero. So that's what I'm going to do now. Okay, okay there it is. So now what I'll do is hit X, zero, Y, zero, and then it says zero, one here. So what I'm going to do is go to initial that's the beginning. So zero, zero. When I'm going to come back to that point, I go right to the zero. To go INC, zero, I'm in the middle. Additional operations will be different settings on here. Zero, one, zero, two. I have over 200 on this machine. So that's the point. Now we're in the center of the machine, center of the mill. Okay, now we've finished indicating and I've mounted the piece that we're going to machine. And in fact, this is it here. This is the second one. I made two on a lathe earlier and we're machining up the cover for the marker lights. Now what I'm going to do at this point is we're going to drill two holes that represent where the wing nuts are going to go. The space of the bolt hole circle is 900 thousands. So zero center, I want to go 450 away from center. Now that's where I'm at right now. You see the X of the machine this way is 450 thousandths. Y, we're going to keep that locked here so it doesn't move this way. So I'm right in the middle of that rotary table. So what I'm going to do now is turn on the machine. I'm going to just touch that off with the center drill and then I'm going to drill the holes. I'm going to rotate. It. It's a drill for clearance hole for a 172 bolt. Cutting away, 
and I go to a mark, I have set up here a red mark, a little grease pencil, and I mark it, and I go around to that mark, so I don't cut away where the hole is. I don't want to leave that portion. I go around to the mark, and then I'm going to refine it a little bit later. thousands so I'm gonna take another couple thousands and that's it zero start again <laughs> 